Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Crochet with Zara and welcome to the episode 13 of How to Crochet's Granny Square series. Today we are blooming with beauty as we create the charming popcorn flower granny square. This delightful design combines texture and elegance perfect for blanket, advanced or home decor projects. Grab your hook and yarn and let's get started into this crochet tutorial. For this project I am using these two colors. This blue color is for the flower and beige color is for the square. So let's get started by taking a blue color. Just make a magic circle. Take the one end on the left hand and the working yarn on the right hand and wrap it around your finger in such a way that it makes an X. Now take the 3 mm hook and insert it under the bottom yarn and pull up the upper yarn and twist it to make a loop and chain one from the working yarn. Now work 8 single crochets into the magic circle. Insert the hook into the magic circle. Pull up the loop. You have 2 loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through 2. This is a single crochet. Now work 7 more single crochets into the magic circle. Insert the hook into the magic circle. Pull up the loop. You have 2 loops. Yarn over, pull through 2. Now work total of 8 single crochets into the magic circle. 3. 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. Now pull the tail to close the circle. Not, do not pull it too tight. I just want to make a little hole in it. Just count the stitches 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and work one more single crochet into the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. Now you have total of 8 single crochets. Now insert the hook into the first stitch, pull up the loop and pull through to make a slip stitch. Now we are going to work a popcorn stitch into each stitch. Now chain 3 for the second round. 1, 2 and 3. This chain 3, I will count it as a double crochet. Now work 3 double crochets into the same stitch where the chain 3 emerges. You have 3 loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through 2. Yarn over, pull through 2. Now again yarn over, insert the hook into the stitch. Pull up the loop. 3 loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through 2. Yarn over, pull through 2. Now again work a last double crochet. Now you have total of 3 double crochets including this chain, sorry, you have total of 4 double crochets including this chain 3. Now, pull the loop a little up, take out the hook. Insert the hook into the chain 3, top of the chain 3 and insert the hook into the loop and pull that loop through the chain 3. Now this stitch is called popcorn stitch. Now chain 2, 1 and 2. Now work 4 double crochets into the next stitch. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now pull the loop up. Insert the hook into the first double crochet and pull this loop through the first stitch of double crochet. This is the second popcorn stitch. Now chain 2 and repeat the same pattern in total of 8 single crochets. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now pull the loop. Insert into the first double crochet stitch and pull that loop through the first stitch. Chain 2. Repeat the same popcorn stitch pattern until you reach here. Now I have worked total of 8 popcorn stitches. Now chain 2 and slip stitch into the first stitch. Now I have worked round 2. 
Now for the round 3, slip stitch into the chain 2 space and work chain 3. 1, 2, 3. Yarn over and work 3. Double crochets. 1, 2, and 3. Now pull the loop a little up, insert the hook into the chain 3. Insert the hook into the loop and pull through the now chain 2 and work one more popcorn stitch into the same chain 2 space. Work 4 double crochets 1, 2, 3, 4. Pull the loop up, insert into the first stitch and pull that loop through the first stitch. Now chain 2. Work 2 popcorn stitches into the chain 2 space. Yarn over, insert the hook into the chain 2. Work 4 double crochets. 1, 2, 3, and 4. Now pull the loop up. Insert the hook into the first. And pull through the loop and pull through the first stitch. Now chain 2, work one more popcorn stitch into the chain 2 space. 1, 2, 3, 4. Pull the loop, loop, pull the loop little up. Insert the hook into the first stitch. Insert into that loop and pull through the first stitch. Now repeat the same stitch pattern until you reach there. Now, I have reached the end and at the end we have total of 16 popcorn stitches. Now, insert the hook into the chain 2 space and pull through to make a slip stitch, chain 1 and slip off the yarn. Now that our flower, popcorn flower is completed. Now, join the next color in any of the chain 2 space. And work total of chain 4. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now this chain 4 I will count as a triple crochet. Now work 2 more triple crochet into the same space. Yarn over twice. Insert the hook into the chain 2 space. Pull up the loop. You have 4 loops on the hook. Yarn over. Pull through 2. Yarn over. Pull through 2. Yarn over. Pull through 2. Now again yarn over twice. Insert the hook into the chain 2 space. Pull up the loop. Yarn over, pull through 2, yarn over, pull through 2, yarn over, pull through 2. Now chain 2, 1 and 2. Now again work 3 more triple crochets into the same chain 2 space. Now again work 2 more triple crochets. Yarn over twice. Now this is my first corner of the square. Now chain 1 and work 3 double crochets into the next chain 2 space. Sorry, we are not going to work chain 1. We just work 3 double crochets into the chain 2 space. 1, 2 and 3. Now into the next chain 2 space work 3 half double crochets. Insert the hook into the chain 2 space, pull up the loop, 3 loops on the hook, yarn over, pull through all the 3 loops. This is half double crochet, now yarn over, work 2 more half double crochets into the same chain 2 space. Now yarn over, insert the hook into the next chain 2 space, work 3 double crochets. Now into the next chain 2 space, we are going to work another corner by working 3 triple crochets, chain 2 and 3 triple crochets into the same chain 2 space. Yarn over twice. Now yarn over twice, insert the hook into the chain 2 space. Yarn over, pull through 2, yarn over, pull through 2, yarn over, pull through 2. Now again yarn over twice, insert the hook into the chain 2 space. 
yawn over pull through 2 yawn over pull through 2 yawn over pull through 2 now yawn over twice insert the hook into the chain pull through 2 yawn over pull through 2 now chain 2 and work 3 more triple crochets into the same chain 2 space yawn over twice yawn over twice now you have you can see we have just completed over two corner first corner second corner and one side of the square in the same way work two double sorry work three double crochets into the chain two space three half double crochets three double crochets and again we have reached at over corner where we work three triple crochets chain two and three triple crochets into the same chain two space now repeat the same pattern and i will meet you here now i have reached the end of the round now into the chain four work a slip stitch to end the round now if you are satisfied with the size you can cut off your yarn but i am going to make another round now we have to reach here so we will make slip stitch again slip stitch and slip stitch into the corner now work chain 3 1 2 3 yarn over and work two double crochets chain 2 yarn over chain 2 and three double crochets into the same chain two space now this is our first corner now into the space between the granny stitches work three double crochets one two and three now again work three uh, double crochets or a granny stitch into the space between the granny stitch now into the next space work three double crochets one two and three now into the next space work three double crochets one two and three now into the next corner work Three double crochets, chain two and three double crochets into the same chain two space. One, two, three, chain two and three double crochets into the same space to increase in the corner. Now repeat the same stitch pattern. Three double crochets into the into this space. 3 double crochet into the this space, 3 double crochet into this space, into this space, 3 double crochets, now 6 double crochets with a chain 2 in between and reach here. Now I have reached the end. Now into the chain 3, work a slip stitch, chain 1 and slip of the yarn. And that's a wrap. Your gorgeous popcorn flower granny square is now completed. You have successfully combined popcorn stitches and granny square magic. Explore more free patterns and tutorials on my channel at the Red Crochet with Zara. Thanks for hooking along with me. Happy crocheting. And I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take great care of yourselves. Bye.